welcome back. Welcome to game night, and tonight we are playing The Mummy Demaster, uh, created by WayForward, who uh, has made games like the Shantae series, and nice. uh, Switch Force, and uh, DuckTales Remastered. Mm -hmm. And uh, so one thing I can tell you about this game, uh -huh. and I think I've already told you, is that Imagine the Mummy movie with Tom Cruise, but uh -huh. without the Tom Cruise. I gotcha. See, I, I didn't even see that one, unfortunately. Yeah, I didn't see that either. Yeah. I, I kind of heard it was bad, I That's think? what I heard, too. Yeah. I was like, oh, it made me sad. Yeah. So, I never got around to uh, beating the game. Okay. I only died six times. That's not bad. Yeah, and surprisingly, the game's a lot shorter than I remembered, like six hours? Huh. So, nice. the thing is, oh... Hey. Oh wait, we can cut here. So it was shorter than you thought. Uh, yeah. Sorry, we're back. Uh, yeah, like... Uh... I thought the game was, like, longer? Yeah? Uh, maybe not. Yeah. Kind of like when we played Luigi's Mansion. Uh-huh. Like, playing that as a kid for the first time. Yeah. It took a good amount of time. Didn't it take us, like, just two sessions this time? For Luigi's Mansion? Yeah, yeah. It's only, like, we only played it twice. Or maybe three times. Shoot. Let's see... Uh, maybe three. Yeah, yeah at, think, at least three yeah, sessions. I think, I think it was three. It, it wasn't. It wasn't four though. No, definitely not four. It was like four. super, super short. Yeah, I feel you. Now, now that we're older, I feel like games got yeah. like a little bit easier. Some games. Yeah. So, Other games, so Ezra, one question I have for you. What is your question? Would you like? Okay, so I mean, this is the platformer, of course. But <laughs> would you like to try this out, or should I just go on? You, you, you go ahead and do it. I okay. think I think people have seen enough of me dying on spikes and stuff. Yeah. <laughs> to like get that lifetime. All right. Oh my uh, gosh. Uh, Protogaeum agents are a rare breed, trained to identify and react to situations far beyond. Oh. Very well. Okay. Whatever. I mean, you can pause it. Yeah, you can pause it and read and, it, and you can read it on your own time. It's like. <laughs> That's what it said. It said, I am yeah. Tom Cruise, and I made a bad movie. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, so the thing is, with this game, and I know I've told you this before, but in case if someone uh, doesn't know what the the special catch is with this game, is that uh, when you die with all the items and upgrades that you pick up, uh -huh. That nameless soldier becomes a zombie, and you have to kill that zombie to get all your stuff back. Okay. Which is really interesting. Okay. So the less you die, the better. I got you. Say. I can do that. Uh, all right, Agent, we lost contact with our ground team several hours ago due to a developing situation elsewhere. We will be going in alone to investigate any signs of a disturbance and reestablish contact with the ground team. This is an area of great importance, and steps must be taken to maintain the security at all costs. Good luck. Okay. Nice. Ooh, a little. Okay, so I kind of, I kind of slowed down as I let go of the control stick. Good job. Um, we got infinite ammo. Was go. there, was there a button that? Okay, it's at the left trigger, where I can like stay in place and just aim. <laughs> I like that. Okay. So. <laughs> All these covers are unstable. Proceed cautiously. You should be able to jump over any uneven patches with B. Uh, don't get too meta with this. Obviously, you remember this from your Prodigium training, but simulation and field work are two different beasts. Yeah. Once you get your barracks, locate the ground team and reestablish their communication with Prodigium. Uh, let's see. What? No? Okay. Anything happen if you. Previous reports, I know. Sorry, I didn't. I don't mean to be annoying. Previous <laughs> reports from our agents suggest the presence of unnatural life forms in the caverns. It may be beneficial to destroy any such entities until we understand what happened to the ground team. Seems like something you should I know. I need to find out what happened with the ground team. <laughs> That's like the third time you it, told me. It seems like this is stuff he should have told you before you like fast roped in. Just saying, yeah. like probably should have planned that a little bit better. If the dog can seem unreachable, you can focus your shorts by pressing. Okay, so it's any trigger button. Gotcha. That is that button, allowing you to aim your weapon in any direction. Okay. Yeah, I've heard. I heard that like in the movie or whatever. Like that's uh, Doctor Jekyll, right? Wait, from where? Like from from the movie, like in the the movie, the the, the mummy, like with Tom Cruise and stuff. 
there's uh, Russell Crowe who plays that guy, but he's also like, but they were trying to like introduce like a type of uh, like monster verse kind of thing. Yeah. And uh, AJ, there may be legends in the cavern. Yeah, I know. Okay. You know what? Yeah, I'm just yeah, gonna skip through it. I know yeah. what I'm doing. I can take that. But like, but like, I heard that like they were trying to do like the uh, like a uh, a monster cinematic universe kind of thing. Ooh. But because of the way the mummy like kind of like sucked, that they like it kind of got a little bit less funding for the next phase than it could have. Like, okay, I kind of feel like everybody's gonna try to do a Marvel film now. Like, try to do it like like the Marvel Cinematic Universe. Just make a monster cinematic universe. Yeah, yeah. I mean, they're doing it with the Godzilla movies now. But, like, but then, but no one's going to capture that magic. Even DC's trying. I mean, like, Shazam was a good movie. So was Aquaman. Oh, Shazam was good. Yeah. So was Aquaman and Wonder Woman and stuff. And, like, I mean, Justice League was okay. Uh, the... <sighs> shut up, shut up, shut up. Yeah, just crawl. Oh, wait. If you find yourself unable to proceed, crouch and then push beautiful. Okay. All right. That's it's good like, to know. It's like, standard tutorial, it's tough. Standard tutorial, uh, what's it called? Uh, what would that be? Standard tutorial, uh, dialogue. Uh, the more you know. Ugh. Okay. No, I, thank you. I'm not sure if, like, if I dodge roll, I can, like, be invincible for a moment, but I doubt it. Um, ooh, what do we got here? Hey, what's up, Puff? I will die. What's up, Smeagol? What are you doing? Oh. Oh. See, he's got a gun, too. Zombies can't shoot. Well, no, but they are they were soldiers. That's great. I'm sure a lot of zombies were, like, car salesmen and stuff, too, but, like, they're not good. AJ, come in. <laughs> AJ, if you're going to hear this transmission, I'm seeing unprecedented readings across the entire region. A bomb is trying to return to the drop point immediately. I repeat, return to the drop point immediately. Okay. Like, like I said, so like, I'm like, gonna try to not die. I'm sure there's like, on the way like zombie car sales with this stuff. They're not gonna go sell cars. Doesn't mean the soldier ones can just like start shooting people. I don't know why that bothers me so bad. <laughs> like, like, I don't know what, what the deal is. Wait a minute. There shouldn't be any of those spiders around here because the. Uh... Whoop. Yep, they can jump too. See, see. Again. I don't know why that bothers me. Oh, dude, speaking of zombies, Ooh. Zombieland 2's coming out. Okay. Yeah, I think I've seen the trailer for that. Oh my gosh. It's not, it's not like zombie, Zombieland Double Tap or something like that. Like, oh. I'm not sure if I've seen the first oh, one, Oh, dude. It's on Netflix right now. Uh, you gotta see it. Was the first it. one a really old movie? No, dude. Zombieland came... Well, it depends, depends on how you, what you think is old. I mean, it came out in like 2009. I mean, so it's, yeah, it is 10 years old. So it is, it is 10 years old. But, like, it was like, it's still one of my favorite movies of all time. Look at this spider to, like, here. Oh! Ooh. I forgot, like, other soldiers. Okay, no self. If I can jump, they can jump. That's Man. a good rule to remember by. Man jump on them and then they won't and then oh that's it cool zoop all right let's do the mario approach all agents report for duty immediately code red situation currently in progress commanders have been issued drop coordinates and organized strikes will continue yeah okay fine i'm not gonna read that that's going too fast for me to read you guys can read it <laughs> freaking zombie yeah. agents <laughs> yeah so like i don't know let's see Zombieland kind of, like, intentionally ignores a lot of zombie rules. Yeah. Like, for example, zombies can run. Yeah. Right, it was typical zombies, like, can't, because they're reanimated corpses. And then, uh, like, everywhere still has power. Right. Right, like, like, everywhere still got power, so it's like, I mean, that's kind of something. But, at the same time... <laughs> you shoot the freaking bird. They're, yeah, they're considered enemies too. Nice. Like, the, I think they'll like swoop down later on. Gotcha. Okay, so I can't go here. I have the, uh... Um... 
what was I gonna say? Oh yeah, but, like, it, it, but it's like funny. So it's, I mean, it's a zombie comedy movie. Yeah. Right. So I mean, that's pretty cool. You know, like, like I can dig that. Have you ever seen a zombie romantic comedy? Yeah, that one, the Fido. No. It's called Warm Bodies. Oh, I thought you were talking about Fido. Like, remember that was one your dad had? I don't think I've like, seen that one though. Oh yeah. But yeah, Warm yeah. Bodies, that was a uh, good one. Yeah, I've, I haven't seen that one. But the like, uh, Fido, Fido was a good one. It's yeah. like there's a zombie apocalypse, and then they like find a way to control the zombies' brains and make them do like menial jobs and stuff. Yeah. Yeah. And oh then, wait, like, I think that's the one. Then, I was like thinking they, of. they get the the one as a pet, but then it falls in love with like the kid's mom. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> oh. Oh, that that's bad. A, that was such a funny movie. And it's like... <laughs> just like that. <laughs> and it's like super in love with its mom. And it's like so like sad. <laughs> exactly. Because it's like supposed to be the dog. But it's like bringing her flowers like... <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. That was such a funny movie. <laughs> I haven't seen that one for like probably like 12 years, dude. Oh my gosh, that's great. Oh, good to hear from you, Agent. I trust you were able to locate this terminal with little trouble. This is the save room. You can resume the mission here at a later time, and we can use it to track your progress in the event you become compromised. Several Progeum techs touch down ahead of you and should be nearby. They're holding up equipment, which will be extremely useful during the mission. And put imperative if we hope to stand a chance against Amanate's power. Look for these texts as you get a feel for the area. I'll be monitoring you from Prodigium headquarters and we'll contact you with relevant information and keep your ways about you. Why can't I be at her, 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 her headquarters? That's like, that seems like the place to be. Yeah. Man. Oh. That looks like a, an 80s TV setup. You've got like it's like a sleepover from the eighties. Yeah, like and then kind you of a weird TV thing. and satellite. You got like a bed roll down there on the bottom left. Yeah. The satellite looks like you've just like attached a couple like hangers and something to something <laughs> else and hopes to catch some kind of signal. Yeah. It's like all of a sudden your parents have like dress things like hung up. Wow, rats. Wouldn't, wouldn't this be the ideal pest control? Rats. Yeah, just, like, like blast them away. Yeah, with infinite ammo. Oh yeah, yo. So okay, so there's a comedian, uh, Bert Kreischer, like who, who I follow on Instagram. So like, so in LA apparently there's a rat problem. Yeah. Yep. Like they they got like a whole bunch of rats and stuff, and so at his house, his cat, right? So like he he's there, like they're sitting, he's like. His cat brings in this big freaking rat, right? And this thing's probably like, like a foot long. Sorry. Now, bro. Headshots, bro. Whoop. Okay. Whoop. Okay. See, can I can I draw dodge roll? Oh no, I can't. Dude, no, dodge roll is not invincible. Okay, good enough. Oh yeah, but like, uh, so like, his family's like freaking out about this, this, uh, cat, the cat bringing this rat into the house. I mean, this thing is monstrous, it's like dead and stuff, but, like, I don't know. Like, I hear that New York is crazy with rats, like, there's tons of them everywhere. Mm. Like, LA's got rats. Remind me not to go there well if it's, if it's that infested. Well, like, I've heard that, like, uh, in New York, that's why like a lot of times on like kind of the side streets or like the side areas people don't walk people walk in the street instead of on the sidewalk because like people got like trash cans and stuff on the side and there's just so many rats that they don't even want to get close to them because like walking on the sidewalk will lead to you like like messing with the rats like i think that sucks like that's kind of i don't know i don't do rats or mice or anything like that so so there you go. When you save, do you, do you like get like your health back? Uh, I mean, you were at 100 percent already. You're at 99 percent already. Maybe. Or 99. I'm no. not sure. Otherwise, it's just the red orbs that you can collect. Beautiful orb. 
Nice. Yeah. So like, yeah. So I wouldn't, I wouldn't mess with like rats like that too. They're rats, bro. Especially those big ones. Yeah. But they, ooh, what about bats? Uh, I don't know. Oh, piranhas! I forgot they were here. And that's a big platform. Okay. Oh no! Oh. Wow. That was pretty bad. Yeah. Yeah, that was uh, that was bad. It's what it was. Oh, get out of there. Get out of there. <laughs> Don't crash around in the water. Okay. Huh? I thought zombies were definitely going to come out of that sand. Yeah. I mean, you think. Just shoot it. Shoot the sand, just to be sure. Give it the double tap. All right, just... Oh, is there yeah. special stuff under underwater there? Yeah, yeah, but I can't go down there because I don't have an ability or... Equipment that lets me uh, swim underwater. I see. So again, this is like one of those uh, Metroidvania type of games. Ow! No! I'm trying to get help! No! Oh. No! There you go, there you go. Yeah, you, can I just... Shoot the fish. I can't shoot through solid ground, oh. so down below. You need a better gun, bro. <laughs> oh, I can get better guns, actually. Nice. Probably not with the one with the ammo, though. Oh! No, no, I'm just gonna stick right here. Like that. Yeah. Okay, you go. And there and go up here. Yeah. Nice. The soundtrack from this reminds me of Stranger Things. You can actually buy the soundtrack on uh on iTunes. Oh nice. Yeah. Something like for ten bucks. So okay. Got a grenade. Hey, I bet that British dude's gonna tell you how to do it. Yeah. Nope, he no. doesn't care. He's like, here, here, take something that you pull a pin out of, and it might blow up in your face, it yeah. might blow up on your butt, but you know what? Here, no tutorial for you. Oh, I can only carry two. Oh. So, whoop! Good thing there's no fall damage. You gotta say, do you get fall damage? You can no. Let's see. Okay. You can throw it. Oh. oh. So it's just straight to the point. Nice. Oh, let's see. What was this? Area map. Nice. Okay. Good. Good. Alright. So, okay. I can't zoom in. So I actually have to, like, lean in. So to the right is where I came in from. So, yeah. I just, I just have to go down. Agent, I have to teach you how to use a map, but I'm pretty sure you know how to use a grenade. Yeah. Anyway, is it? Is a technician <laughs> there with you? I'm seeing some odd readings from their bio tracker. I see. Fortunately, they left their daily log behind with the topographical information they gathered. This will automatically upload to your own map readout, giving you some idea of what's ahead. Please use the data to locate the other three techs immediately. They've lo all lost contact with Protegium, and I fear the worst. The last known locations have been marked on your map. Proceed to these areas immediately, and ascertain the threat level to our men. Hurry, Agent. Hey, don't rush me, bro. Alright, so I have to go to those spots. Okay. That's what I have to do. That technician is dead. Oh. Oh, yeah, you're right. There, There's a dead person. Right that is there. unfortunate. Give it a double tap just in case it's a zombie. That's my. That, I still argue that I invented that move <laughs> before, like anybody else did it on Halo. I guarantee that I invented that move. Like, and it was just. And honestly, should, should like, that still be on Game Night or can it should? It should. It, it's okay. That's a. That's a move that like literally everybody in their job does now. But yeah. I still argue that I invented it. The the tea bag. I still argue my invention. Okay, wait, I actually need a... I think I actually need power for this thing. Gotcha. To access that well, there was another, uh, like, locked door, like, uh, like, boarded up door. Yeah. The ways back. Yeah, back up. Yeah. That's where I need to go. But yeah, anyway, I still, I still argue that I invented that. And honestly, I just made it to piss off. I just did that to piss off Zeke with a red coat on Halo. <laughs> like, I really did. Like, I was just like, ah, I'm gonna mess with him. So, but like, 
so like typically you know, I don't play nope. Nope. like a lot of Halo. Especially anymore, you know, like, okay. like like I used to play it a lot, but like now I only play every once in a while, like multiplayer with like like my brother in law Jacob or whatever. Yeah. Like we we uh we play it but uh even when I play with him I, I keep bag it <laughs> it's like funny. And like I said, like 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 I said, I'm, I'm still positive that I invented it, you know, but you never know. Right, like, so, someone else might have done it, but I'm pretty sure that I invented that. But the, uh, um, like, it, it drives Zeke crazy when I do it. It's like, oh, like, why are you doing that? It's like, I don't know, just for this. Because the more frustrated you get, you know, you don't play so great. And everything. So, remember when we'd all like play Halo 3 and Halo ODST when it was on the Xbox? Halo 3, but I don't. What was the other one? Uh, Halo 3 ODST. It's just like a. Di like, it was kind of like. I would almost be willing to say it was like early version, like style DLC mm -hmm. for uh, Halo 3. It was kind of like going on that, around like the same time. Wow. Ooh, yeah, yeah projectiles. There are bats all over the place. And I want to see what is actually up ahead. Nice. Ooh. They're just spitting out what, like blobs of blood or something? Ectoplasm, I want to say. Uh, Bactoplasm. They're go They're like going in like. But what they're doing is they are, uh, I don't even, I don't even know. Okay, guys, you're gonna, you're gonna have to let me go, please. I think there's just, like, unlimited spawning of zombies there. Yeah, I, I think that's the whole point of this game. I got you. So, like, so, like, here's, I got a question for you. Yeah. So zombies have almost become like action stars of themselves kind of thing. So like, like what kind of zombie do you think is the most scary? Like out of all the zombie movies you've ever seen, mm -hmm. which zombies are the most scary? Like what scare you? Probably the ones that run fast. I agree, like the ones from World War Z? Yeah. Forget about it, dude. Uh, but uh, then again, like, there are other zombies, like in the in the game called uh, The Last of Us, which I mean we could play uh -huh. play the game. Yeah, right? yeah. Um, there are a few there are a few other kinds of zombies. Uh, there's one called the Clicker, uh -huh. and uh, the thing is, it's blind, but it's sound sensitive. So if it hears something, it will go uh -huh. after it. I gotcha. And then there. I think there's another kind that like throws these uh, bombs at uh -huh. you. Okay. Like made out of its own flesh. Okay. Let's see, kind of an odd way to uh, design for a bomb. Yeah. You know? Hey. I, I think there's some other kinds of zombies. Got but... some extra skin here. Gonna make a bomb. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, I don't quite remember what other kinds of zombies there are. There's like a regular zombie. Then there were clickers. Okay. Then, so you're more like 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 the zombies that are more scary to you are like the fast ones and the ones that kind of have like special. Abilities. I'd be terrified if they can move fast. Oh yeah, like I think like if they move slow enough, it's like all right, you know. Yeah, like, you know, I could just easily like walk on out of here. Yeah, yeah, it's now like oh my gosh, it's like I gotta I gotta run, you know. Like, yeah. Oh, like, I gotta exercise. I mean. Yeah, you got you gotta like stay in shape for that, but like with, at that point, it's like you know. Oh, we got two there. Nice. <laughs>